One of the greatest questions of life is do I or don't I remove the hi-hats when painting the ceiling? This question has led to the collapse of empires, started wars, and has made generations go insane. Stop Cruz using witchcraft on me to get the fire off me! So let's find out. I'm gonna show how to paint around this without removing the hi-hat, because sometimes when you take them down, they don't go back up. As I said before, I'm doing a wall paint because I want to show you the difference compared to white on white. And if I hit the hi-hat, you can wipe it off. See, I'll hit it on purpose here, and I'll wipe it off. I'll reposition the ladder so I can see it. I'll start away from the light and come in, depending on how the brush is behaving. Because you have too much paint on your brush, and you get too close, it'll just start gopping up. I'm getting it all over the hi-hat. And then I'll go out a brush length, just so when we roll it later, that it's much easier. Number one done. On to number two. All right, for these hi-hats, most of them you have to take out the light, but some of them you don't. For this one, you do. So in this one, there are two springs. One here, the other one here. And if you get the handy-dandy needle-nose pliers, we can take them down. One. Come on. You can, there we go. So we're not gonna just roll through these. You can do that, but it gets a lot of this stuff and it gets in the paint, just old drywall, and it gets in the paint, just leaves chunks everywhere. So I like to still cut around this, and then I'll go ahead and roll, but when you roll, you can get really tight, and it's just much easier to work that way. Look at that sweet hole. Now we're gonna put the hi-hat back up. Uh. So this is number one. See if it works. Oh. <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Uh, here, here it is, right, right there, right there. This is why sometimes I don't take these down because they are a pain in the butt to put back up. So here's attempt number two. Come on, little buddy. Get back in there, little doggy. Come, oh, oh, come on. I believe in you and me. Not all these are designed the same, so take down, if you're gonna take them down, take down one, see how it goes, and put it back up. I would recommend that. So this one, oh, I don't have a good, oh, ah. and it flew. Where did they hit you? Oh, hit my poor brother. Where, where did it go? Over my shoulder. All right, find it. Temp number three. I feel good about this one. Get in there, come on. Yes. And on these, just go until it is hand tight. 